Vocaloid, a style of vocals that I know close to nothing about. I am super removed. Very ignorant. I think maybe in the Twitch live streams I've heard five songs, but that is the genre of today's Patreon request video. We have a tier four member, which means they can pick any song they want for the channel. They have asked to remain anonymous, so obviously we're going to respect that. Now, I'll be honest with you. Vocaloid so far has been a hard sell for me, but there's a couple sayings I like to live my life by. Number one, you already know it. Variety is a spice of life. I say it all the time in here. And the other is the more you know, the more you know you don't know. With that being said, Artists, musicians, people that are creative, the more of them, the more varieties, the better. So I like to keep an open mind with that. This is Wowaka, Unknown Mother Goose. I'm excited. Let's go. <laughs> That was an intro. There's so much stuff going on. I'm sorry. I got caught up in the uh, da -da 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 the cool guitar comping part that I didn't really notice the uh, the drums are pretty awesome. Oh, I didn't even see the piano part. So I got left side guitar, right side piano arpeggios. That's funky. But it's the kick drum part. I f it sounds like a New Orleans street band. That bass drum part is so funky. Listen to this. That hits, man. There are so many sounds going on. Then that other little keyboard melody came in. There's a lot to listen to. That's different. Wow. That's fascinating. What a way to pull you back in. You go from multi textures and layers in the intro. That little music interlude just breaks down to two things. You got the bass line groove, you got the seaboard, the seaboard, the synth groove, the keyboard groove there, and the drums. What a vast difference immediately. That's fascinating. All right, let's keep going. So bass. Okay, the vocal sound, the vocaloid sound is so fascinating. Question for the consumer. So if we fade out the guitar part, the bass part, the drums part, we fade it all down and you just listen to the timbre, the sound of the vocaloid sound. It's interesting because it almost gets camouflaged in between that keyboard sound, just where it's like laying. I want to know for you, the consumer, what was the attraction for the sound? Because to me, it's still so foreign. Like this is such a new concept to me. Was it an acquired, sorry, an acquired listening taste? Did you love it immediately? Did you not like it for a while? And did, it, did you like come around on it? I mean, we do it in other ways. Like we listen to all kinds of other music and like, those aren't real strings. Those are, that's not a real trumpet player. It's all just done in a DAW. This is the same thing, right? Even though it's a real person sampled, we're using it in the same way that we would in, that when we patch other things. So to me, the concept's still new, but I don't really care about me. I want to know about you. So tell me more about how you came on it and like where you're at with your journey with it, because I do find it fascinating. Let's go back five and keep going here. We go and there's another chill breakdown. Uh, the vocal rhythms, all this stuff going on. Wow, that's super fun. I mean, obviously, we're programming it in, but, but who cares? It's still grooves, man. Uh, where are we going now in this progression? <laughs> Yeah, man. Clever use of rhythm. Ba, uh, uh, the ga -ga -da. Space is there. We got those like, little leaps. All the, the intervals are really nice. I feel like, yeah, it's catchy. It's cool. Uh, the progression and groove, though, is so smooth in comparison to what we've already heard, though. So, But you know me. I like variety. So back five. Let's keep going here. <laughs> it's a wild sound.
It's simple, but I love it. Da -da 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 then you do that with the cross stick thing on the stair. That grooves, man. I, I love it every time it happens. Go back to it. I need that again. That's a nice little, nice little variation. Yeah. That's fun. Okay, that is funky as hell. The what's happening on guitar versus I don't know if it's keyboard or other guitar layer. This kind of melodic versus the voice, <laughs> the way the guitar part and bass part are happening. Uh, that's very cool. Sorry, I need that again. I'm going back 15 because. <laughs> Man, there's like some stratosphere harmonies supporting the voice there in the keyboard. It's like way up there. Uh, nothing was complicated about all those layers and the entrances, like the way the guitar came in, the way the bass came in. But the groove factor is extreme though, right? It's going to get people dancing. That's the, uh, that is the important part. Any kind of music at the very end of the day, you boil it down to, it needs to be entertaining. This is definitely entertaining. I dig it. Back five. Let's keep going. <laughs> That's fascinating. That's a variation on what we heard before. I feel like we had more drone though. Basically, our rhythm or just big open long chords being played as our vocals did the dig 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 stuff over the top of that. It's just wild. And now we're coming back into our like low key groove here. That's the first time we're getting that. Um, scots, scots. That, that's a hard. Okay. I will say this. Still brand new, right? This is probably vocal aid song number six. This is by far the best one that I've heard simply because of how catchy and accessible all the background stuff is that's supporting this different style of voice. But the grooves are good. Every single one of these grooves was awesome, especially that New Orleans one in the beginning. So that that's probably why I got, I got sold pretty early. But I definitely am not complaining. And I've complained before on these. <laughs> Is that our ending piano chord? Okay, yeah, like this was different. I can honestly tell you this is, uh, I was prepared to not dig this. That's not the case. So I think this is the first Vocaloid song that I've liked. So that's awesome. I'm glad this was the request. 
But remember, what I what I think doesn't matter. I want to know what you think, so make sure you let me know in the comments down below. My name is Drumroll Tony. Make sure to catch me live on Twitch so we can talk about your favorite Vocaloid artists or just music in general. You can find the link to my Twitch channel in the video description below as well as the Discord server invite. Please and thank you. Click that like button, subscribe to the channel so you can catch the next one. All right, thank you so much. If you want to support me, my Patreon information is down there. I appreciate it for watching. Take it easy. Bye-bye.